Go ahead. Um, so my name is Rare Farmer, and this is my daughter, Opal. And I moved here a little over a year ago uh, from Emeryville, and previous to that, my husband and I uh, both lived in Fort Worth, Texas. Uh, so the space is small, I mean, you're here, it's not too big. So I'm gonna try to cram as many books on the walls as I can and then leave the space for people to, you know, come and enjoy books themselves, some music, um, really just to have another community space that's open downtown. And maybe that will bring other businesses to open their doors downtown. Cohan Press, um, I got the name. I was in a, um, in a talk with the author Ravi Ravindra um, a couple of years ago and he was speaking about, about the mantra Koham Soham, which is spoken into infants' ears. Um, and the question is, who am I or who I am? Um, and that really resonated with me as like kind of my journey and what's going been going on with my life. Um, so it stuck and right after that I, I wrote um, my first short story <laughs> and, and published it myself. Um, and so, yeah, I, I just felt like that opening a bookstore and the next step being a publishing company uh, or small press really is the way that I want to go. I'm getting a lot of feedback from other small presses, which is great because there's a lot of small presses that are just getting started or have been, you know, doing a great job. Adam Robinson um, from Publishing Genius Press, he's like a great resource and is going to be just so helpful. Um, he's already been really helpful. Um, so just for people who are really passionate about keeping books alive, um, that's that's where I'm. I'm just trying to tap into those resources and you know figure out how to make what I want to do happen. So we're doing a Kickstarter. It's up now. Um, you can check it out on our website. It's www.cohompress.com. And that tells a little bit more about ourselves. We did a video that has some great shots of Alejo. And right now we're doing really well. We're seeking $5,000, um, which is the money that was kind of beyond my personal resources for some of the things I needed to do for the store um, without going into mounds of debt. <laughs> um, anyway, uh, so, and also I was just kind of curious to see like how people would respond to yeah right um to having a book yeah. and just if i can get support with that then i feel like that the bookstore will be supported a, a little bit more than maybe what the past bookstores have been supported um and i really think that now we're kind of at a time in this city there's so much going on with the hub down the street and you know Aaron Bakke's doing great things the wine walk and open studios is going on now so I just feel like the gardens are opening up down the street there's just a lot of really things great things going on that I think um, people are just kind of ready for a change and I mean we're the ones that are going to be able to do it so you know that's my spiel <laughs>